everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button guys, and remember to share to everyone that you like and you don't like. Blang! And guys, it's Manchester United 1, Wolverhampton 0, Manchester United Injury time winner, smash and grab winner, you don't know, Marcus Rashford, Sir Marcus Rashford, scoring us the winning goal, sending Manchester United second place, two points behind Liverpool guys, and to end the year with a win, nine games undefeated run, smashing, 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 cheese, cheese cake, I'm gas, I am gas guys, I know you're gas, I'm gas, two points behind Liverpool, Liverpool still got to play their game, which means that it will be back to about five points, but knowing us, with our game in hand, it's actually realistic that we can be two points behind Liverpool playing the same amount of games. Right now, guys, wow, 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 wow. We have to count our locks, count our locks. Guys, you know, just to win that game in the dying seconds, there is God. There is God, oh, there is God. Trust me, there is definitely God. Marcus Rashford, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for that win, guys. Guys, oh, Oh, I'm feeling good. I am feeling good. Look, I'd put my shades on. You know I was gonna pop champagne, but I was like, nah, nah, calm down. I thought it's like, calm down. But guys, let's go straight into that match. Let's go straight into that match. I ain't gonna lie. The first 30 minutes, of course, at the match being nil-nil, nothing much in, in the game. Match pretty much even. With Wolves having the better chances, having a pop of our goalkeeper, David De Gea, me there, me thinking, geez, man, I hope we don't lose today because we don't need this right now. And they're just going to start proving that we lack bulls. But today, we did not lack bulls. We had two big fat bulls, you get me? The boys had bulls, rock sacks, two rock sacks, you know? Mark Strashford himself today was packing. But yeah, as I said in the first half, pretty much even. Any nil nil going towards half time. Second half as well was pretty much the same, guys, you know? Wolves as well again having a pop out goalkeeper. We as well having a, a good chance or two. I want to say we had the best chances trying to break the lines against Wolves defence. That did not work today guys. Pfft, we cannot break anything. We can't break anything at all guys. You know what I mean? Like, I, 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 What do we do in training? I, I've been saying this for a very long time. What do we do in training? I, I don't know. I just don't know, but we cannot break lines, you know, we cannot break a defensive line and and I'm, I, many times I've seen the Manchester United trying to pass the ball, recycling, 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 you can clearly see that, bruv, just stop it, just just be direct, like just just stop it, it's really hurting my, my eyes, it's hurting my eyes, it's hurting the whole, everyone else's eyes, like, we don't need to be seeing this. If you can't break the defensive line of your opposition, then what's the point? What's the point trying to show us that you can? Because it just shows me that the next, the negligence of you guys just not being able to do it in training. And again, coaching. Mm -hmm. We're not going to talk about that today. But yeah. And then you're thinking in the 90th minutes, guys. Boy. Ah, uh, no, another draw. Back-to-back -back draws. And, and they're just making it two wins at Old Trafford. Bruh, it just can't be happening. But nah. Not today, Satan. You ain't going to get us. I know we called the Red Devils. But we're going to have one over you, Satan. Nah, 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 nah. Dying seconds. My G, Marcus Rashford came out of nowhere, scoring that goal. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant pass from Bruno from deep, as they call it in basketball, from downtown. What a beautiful pass. And then, of course, Marcus Rashford, one step, two step, shot, took a deflection, but I don't care. We take it as it is. And with Manchester United winning 1 0. 1 0. Guys, I'm gassed. I am gassed. Why wouldn't you be gassed, guys? We are second right now. I don't know. I've been drinking some olive juice, bro. But you know what I mean? Like, am I, sometimes I'm just asking myself, am I, am I really only out or am I buying into this whole thing? Because right now, this whole season's looking nice. You know, we're in the middle of the season right now in whatever series we're watching. And, it, and it's getting good. It's like Game of Thrones. The first season, rubbish. Early season. Second season, oh, getting way better. Now we're going to that part where the wedding's coming. I'm thinking, jeez. I can't wait till the second half, you know, the second half of the season. But guys, good for us. Two points behind Liverpool sitting second. 
Bring it on. Bring it on. I ain't going to say I'm in the title race right now. Good boy. I'm going to wait until we get to March, April. And then from there, if we're still there, that can start talking about cruddy shit. But for now, I ain't going to talk no crud, bro. Because at the end of the day, you know what it's like to be Manchester United. And you know what those team, those players are capable of doing, you know. One day they could be great. Another day they could be shite. Just ch typically shite. Man of the match today. Definitely, you know, Marcus Rashford, it got to be him. The guy that came and saved us, you know, Marcus Rashford. Amen. Man saved us today, bro. Oh, always scoring important goals in, in when we need it as well, you know. You know me, I always get on to Marcus Rashford, but you know, I'll give him his flowers as well because you know why? That's my guy, bro. Don't care the match. I think I has to go to Iron Man Bicycle. It had to go to somebody today, guys. Whether you feel like he doesn't deserve it, I feel like Ari Wambsaka could have done more. Could have done more. Decision making as well, you know, questionable. But apart from that, that's it. That's what I gotta say. Manchester United fans, we are second. Enjoy it for now. Enjoy it because you never know. It can just collapse. It can go pear shape. Knowing this Manchester United team, but I'm hoping this Manchester United team can show some, you know, stability. Continue going into this New Year's. And start playing some good, amazing champagne football because the because the transfer window will be open, guys. And it's, I'm looking forward to who we're gonna be getting. Definitely, guys. It's been wonderful. You know, man's gas right now. I'm happy. I'm so happy right now. You know, my my joy is just fulfilled right now. It's, it's, it's gonna be a good end to the year. Although we got knocked out the Champions League, despite that, it's a it's a good ending towards the year. Just being close, you know, to first place. You know. I'm not saying anything's going to start from here, but, you know, you never know. And, guys, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and share. Get to sharing to people. You get me? And remember to follow the official Instagram account of Red United, which is Red United TV one baby. And remember to follow me on my personal Instagram account, which is Ivorian underscore Spice. Also on the Twitter and also the same on Snapchat, guys. Remember, guys, catch up volume 24 coming out soon. You get me, guys? You know... Been lovely, mess out.